Okay, here with Welling Man of the Match, Fraser Franks, after an impressive 4 0 victory over playoff chasers Boreham Wood. Uh, every inch as impressive as the result that was, wasn't it? Yeah, it's a big win. They've been on form, and I think it sends out a little <coughs> message to Salisbury. If they're here watching, or if Dover are here watching tonight, game three points on them after what could have been about 15 after they come here. So we've done well, but we ain't going to get carried away with it. Apart from the first five minutes, we kind of took the game to Boreham Wood. Um, who got the first goal though? Can we clear that up? Uh, I think Clark is going to claim it. But Ben done well to get on the end of it and it's a little scramble. But I'm sure Clark is going to you know, claim that one, I think. And just like London buses, uh, you've got your first goal on Saturday and you scored a bullet header again. Right, so every club I've been at, I've scored two. And they've all come in game after the back, one game after the other side. So I had a feeling I might get one tonight, but my mate was in goal for them as well, so it's good to stick one past him. Got the bragging rights over, uh, over over him then. Was it important to get the second goal just when we did? Uh, I think it gave us a little cushion, but 2 0 is always a funny scoreline. If they get one back straight away, that was the main message at half time to be clinical when we're, when we're going in front of the goal, but not to concede early or to concede at all. So, yeah, it was, it was good. Yeah, and I think it was important to go 3 0 up in the, in the second half. Unfortunate for their guy to score the own goal, but it was a good run from Jack. Yeah, we know that he's, uh, he's got that in his locker, and I keep on him to do it a bit more than clip it down the channel because he's got that all day in his locker but it's good he's got a few of them this year so we may continue. Obviously we've got a lot of Saturday Tuesday games coming up right until March now how as a squad can we cope with this? Yeah I think we've got the players to do it we've got obviously the young lads we've got three of the normal back five out tonight so that's a big plus for us Barney's come in and done brilliant the last couple of games and JT was solid today as well so I think we've got the players if we've got injuries or whatever so yeah, word on JT uh, because he had to pull off some good saves tonight. Yeah, yeah. Let's not let's not take that away yeah, from yeah, him. Couple, and he done really well. Yeah, he did. Yeah, he's good behind us. He talks and he's experienced, and we knew he could come in and do more than more than capable of doing a job tonight. Big games keep coming. Saturday away at Dover, not an easy place to go to. What's your thoughts? Uh, yeah, it's not a, not an easy place. A little Kent derby, but I thought they were they were decent here. They've gone off a little bit lately, but it's going to be another tough game. Yeah. Well done. Thanks for your time. Cheers. Thank you. Luck.